Yo, yo, this Chase the Stacks TV. What's I'm Chase the Stacks himself. This Pierre 88. For sure. And uh, we all here getting straight live. Um, we getting straight to the point. Let's get it. To me. Alright. Now, I'm going to ask you the first question on this one because okay. this, this has been on my mind like for a long time. What you think about the Amazon fire right now, bro? I feel like it's something that's going on down there that we don't know about and they, they don't want us to find out about. And if we keep, you know what I'm saying, turning the deaf ear to it, this sun going to really be missing out here. I don't know if it might be a, another animal <clears> or, you know what I'm saying? Like, every year it's a, it's a, it's a another endangered species, you right? feel what I'm saying? Where they only got two or three more type of bears or something. Like, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that's just crazy. Like, these bears and all this stuff been around for thousands and thousands of years. Maybe even millions, who knows, you know what I'm saying? But now they even start starting to disappear just because of what stuff. You know what I'm saying? It's just different things that's going on in the agriculture. You feel what I'm saying? And yeah. We not being we not being interested in it don't mean it's not going on. You feel what I'm saying? Right, right. We can turn the deaf ear to it all we want, but it's still it's consequences to turning the deaf ear and not saying nothing sometimes. Yeah. I feel you on that, man. My point on it, uh, the Amazon fire is like, we living on Mother Earth, Mother Nature, dealing with Mother Nature. So it's like, uh, we, we burning her down. Right. You know what I'm saying? And she feel it. You know what I'm saying? And Since she hurt. Yeah, because it's, you know, been existing, coexisting with humans all this time without being on fire all these thousands of years, millions of years. You know, it's, it's sad, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's like all the trees communicate not with the leaves or, you know, on the surface. They communicate through the roots with the other trees. Mm -hmm. And it's proven, you know what I'm saying? This ain't no YouTube or no National Geographic bullshit or Bill Not a Science Guy, but I'm mm -hmm. serious in heart attack right now because um, it's, it's devastating. And I know a bunch of minerals and fruits and a whole bunch of undiscovered type stuff like far as like at the bottom of the oceans of the whole planet you know you know it's aquaculture like you said and you know it's habitats you know what i'm saying they depend on every year seasons and anytime it rain you know you got all type of alive things that's going on and you wonder why they be migrating and coming to vegas with swarms of mm -hmm. uh, not grasshoppers but uh locusts yeah. you know what i'm saying and, you play know, Exactly. So it's ironic that it caught on fire right after the following year of slavery is out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's a whole different subject. But I mean, I just feel bad, man, because ain't nobody making it the new chicken Popeye yeah. sandwich. You know what I'm saying? They're making this shit with genetically modified chicken. Not uh, even blowing that. that shit I think out it's the already portion. shot up or something. I think it got like a little flu in it or something. Nah, something that we don't have to go. By with. now, yeah. But I, some, you know what I'm saying? I, I, just, flu or something. I just can't, you know, I understand the restaurant business, so they don't fuss around or nothing. Yeah. So they already should know from the first day. Yeah. And, you know, Tony Braxton and all these other individuals were wilding out over it. They should have knew the hype was free promotion. Yeah. Cause that's all it's about, man, free promotion. So they say about 15 mil I heard, you know what I'm saying? Like on marketing dollars. They ain't have to do no billboards and staples on motherfucking trees. And yeah. They ain't have to do no nothing. They just let social media just make it viral. And that's the whole platform we own. Because it's already viral. Y'all just don't see it. Because, you know, sometimes you got to get out the matrix a little bit. You feel me? For sure. But at the end of the day, though, you know, I know you got questions. You know what I'm saying? I can go on and on and on and on. Yeah. All right. How you feel about Queen Elizabeth ho hosting the state <clears throat> visit for Trump and his wife? Well, Trump and his wife was on the stage, and the stage was over there in Britain and the UK. Yeah. So um, that alone was a powerful moment that we won't ever comprehend. Well, I, I comprehend it because why is he <clears throat> over there in the first place? I mean, I know ASAP Rocky need to get out of jail and all this shit, but yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, what was that about? Like, like, like I said, the chicken sandwich. 
they fucking brainwashed everybody with that, and mm, they was making another move over there. This shit chess. So you know did you saying? taste the chicken sandwich? And it's right after the, the 400 years out. Did you taste the chicken sandwich? Nah, man, I don't plan on. I ain't about to, I ain't about to lose no sleep and stand in line two hours over some chicken, bro. No, that's number one. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'd take my black ass straight to the grocery store, man. Give me some premium. Right. They, they make a sandwich better than that sandwich because, you know, this chef bar are chicken stacks. You feel mm-hmm. me? But uh, real shit, though, real motherfucking talk. Like, I make it at the crib bar. Yeah. You know, and anybody be, you know, showing up on my side, though, my front, though, and in my uh, business. You know what I'm saying? Support. Some lemon pepper, bro. Nah, man, that's Ross. I ain't, I ain't on that lemon pepper, man. I'm on a hickory oh, smoked barbecue. Oh, that flavor now? I said the hickory smoked barbecue. The recipe coming real soon. Chasing stacks, barbecue seasoning for all them ribs, all them tips, all that dip, all that whip. <laughs> but yeah, let's let's get to the next one. Okay. How you feel about South Korea paying American troops? Just doing business with them in general. I don't even know the, you know what I'm saying. Oh, uh, yeah, that's 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 real uh strategic. Yeah. But uh, I don't, I don't know, man. That's isolated area over there, like North Korea and shit. But they got the lights on. North Korea got the lights off. You yeah. feel me? So, you know, over there on the other side of the world, man, I don't, I won't push shit past shit, man. As far as no media, social media, I mean, news media, none of that, bro. Yeah. I, I just keep on continuing praying for it, the whole world, like I do every day. You feel me? Yeah. Okay. So I just read this though. Egypt unveils one of the one of a kind 4400 year old tomb expect more fun and they expect more fun all right for us the tombs yeah you know uh that pharaoh you got the king tut you know what i'm saying you just you know uh, the sphinx my whole outlook on you know that is uh that was back then you know you think they got nothing to do with today well, I'm, I'm gonna get to that, bro. Yeah. But As in I, history, how I feel, itself. how I feel, bro. I just feel, you know, the, the Gentiles and whoever. I ain't even gonna be on no color shit, but whoever discovered them back in the hey, day. Hey, look at the color, though. Yeah. Whoever discovered the original uh, pyramids back in the day looted. They you think so? not. They knock noses off the Sphinx, so we can identify that it was black people. Well, I don't even like using the word black man. Yeah. I just I just say the chosen ones because we ain't black. You know what I'm saying? And uh, black is just a color. We you not know, about to limit our character and our uh, self human on this is coexisting the earth and mother nature like that with a color. You know what I'm saying? Every animal have a, a name, not a color. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? And um, I just feel, you know, Egypt was brought over here and put in Vegas and they redid it again. You got the Luxor with the pyramid. And I just feel like this the new Vegas, I mean, the new Egypt over here. But Dubai is kind of ahead of us. But the you know, Emirates and, you know what I'm saying? You got to have the passports and all that smooth stuff and check when you go over there but they still built a whole nother land which was like egypt to us you know what i'm saying if something happened to us when we perish that mm-hmm. land might survive you know what i'm saying and the next set of civilization or uh possibly but they said in this uh might look this... at that over there because it might be wiped out completely this time over here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They, they said in this article, though, because that they found some um, some hieroglyphics, you know? That's oh, how they um, communicate. Yeah. What how, they how, to hieroglyphics to is uh, very important because uh, it has to be translated into an understandable language. But at the same time, by you know, them, well, by now, you know, I don't know, I'm pretty sure they're on the planet, you know what I'm saying, already, you know. When I say planet, I mean just, you know, a plane yeah. of uh, everlasting Earth, you know what I'm saying. And I just feel, you know, they already here, man. It's just, uh, they doing what they're supposed to do, and the man upstairs got it all in control. Yeah. You know, 
the, it's another man downstairs and he doing his part too. Because I feel like it's a bet with the most high between top and below. I feel below, you know, did a bet. Like, I bet you I can get more people on my side than your That's side. That's exactly what it is. And then it was like, uh, the most high was like, okay, we'll see. We'll find out. And, you know, Armageddon. It's not even a bet. Armageddon though. coming up. You know what I'm saying? But, uh. Because the most high know everything in the beginning and the end. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? And, mm-hmm. You know what I mean? The salvation is everything for us. Having your, um, your armor of protection. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's number one. But yeah, we on Chase Stacks TV and um, we're about to get this part two coming up right now. Like, share, subscribe, baby. Peace.